welcome to my floss tube channel thread the needle and my Christmas countdown so today is day one and it's going to be the beginning of my Christmas countdown um, it's I don't have any um, stitching to show you yet but that will come as we move on through the days so first of all let me just say that I'm gonna start with my advent coffee um, isn't this a really cool cup I just got it um, I love everything Christmas so this is just so much fun so the coffee I got today for my advent calendar <clears throat> was nutty butterscotch toffee um, I actually got the same calendar that I got last year I'm not sure if um, it's the same order of flavors but I searched for a few different um, advent calendars coffee ones because I really enjoyed the one last year and I ended up getting the exact same because there were a few others out there but they were a little bit too costly and I was like do I really want to spend that much money on <clears throat> some um, coffee flavors so I decided to get the same one because I enjoyed it so much last year so why not so this is the first of my coffee advent calendar and it is super yum I'm gonna enjoy that for the rest of the uh, evening now <clears throat> so today is the first day in our uh, Christmas countdown so day one so I will begin every day with my coffee of the day and then I will tell you um, I've got oh that's right next up I think we should do my um, wax melt advent calendar so day one is right here so I'm gonna open it with you oh so she's got tin foil covering it too so I'm guessing that I just ripped through the tin foil too oh okay hang on there you go so here it is right here let's see it's not very easy to get out but let's see if we can make this happen oh I see what she okay I'm gonna poke it through from behind and here we go oh my god okay hang on I gotta find a place to put this so I don't spill my coffee and oh I'm gonna okay my house is gonna smell amazing okay so just look at the prettiness here I'm gonna see if I can focus that it's like got a little snowflake and the, oh my god how fun okay let's find out what that smell is it's so lovely so number one sea island I was gonna say it smelled a little uh, aquatic oh that's gonna be that's gonna be lovely so most of them are, oh I almost dropped that wax so I think what I might do so that it burns out quickly I might just even do just a quarter of it because I'm gonna have a new one for tomorrow so that's gonna be lots and lots of fun so that's the second part of my Christmas countdown let me just lay that aside do you like my backdrop I wanted to have like a, a little Christmas feel to it I didn't add any lights maybe I will but my daughter helped me uh, design uh, decorate here so I think it's quite fun and a couple little trees to you know sparkle up everything so I don't know if you can tell but there is glitter on that tree too and there's definitely glitter on that one so that's so much fun so uh, we did my coffee of the day which is super yum in my super cool new coffee cup and then we did the wax melt of the day which smells divine next up we have my first gift from my um, crafting group uh, where we did our gift exchange so we had 11 ladies including myself and each one of us was tasked with making 12 handmade gifts and 12 bought gifts but there was only 11 of us so technically from all the other 10 ladies because 11 including myself from 10 of the other ladies I received in total 20 gifts so I won't have one for every day so there might be a day or two that I decide to skip one just so I can catch up uh, and of course I get two of my own so I might just do that or I might um, we'll see what, what I decide to do that so 
This one is from one of the ladies and she has requested in our group chat that we uh, open hers first. Uh, if everyone didn't mind, she thought it would be a really way, nice way to start off our countdown. So I'm going to try and do it so that I'm not ripping through it in my excitement and kind of undoing the knot instead. Um, but let's see. I think I can manage. Perfect. I did set up a little table here next to me to lay all the gifts on so I could have my hands free. Uh, but maybe I need to organize a little bit more just to give myself a little space. But, okay, I'm going to take the tag off. That's really cute. The tree cut out. And it says, Love Secret Santa. Oh, and she signed it. It's from Patty. Patty also has a uh, channel on floss tube and she posts videos wow patty this knot is very secure very secure i may have to just slide it off the side so patty has a, has a channel as well she also lives in newfoundland and she she has been doing this a lot longer than myself um hers is four boys and a an l girl i think so i will see if i can okay ready first okay oh there's multiple stuff in here okay hang on First, we have this. Oh my goodness. So, it looks like um, some loose tea. It's from the Newfoundland Tea Company, and it's premium organic tea, and the flavor is plum pudding. Oh, it has black tea, cornflower petals, raspberry pieces, red plum petals, blueberry pieces, and natural flavors. And this looks like a very exciting teaspoon. Oh, wow. So it looks like you use this side to measure out how much to put in. And then there's a hole right here where it just goes in. And then all these holes, you just let it steep in your tea. Isn't that so cool? That's awesome. And then it looks, this part is taped down. So I'm assuming that will remove and then you can take all the tea out of it. So thank you. So lovely. Okay, next. Oh, I think I see what's coming next. Okay, you guys. It's a mug, and one would think that it would be for drinking tea, but it's not. It's a candle. Oh, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Now, there's one more thing. No, there's a couple more things. Hang on, let me see. Okay. And of course, what goes with a cup? But a saucer. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, so adorable. Thank you, Patty. Okay, and that's it. So we're good. That's just, I want to make sure there's nothing in that tissue paper. No, we're good. Okay. So how fun is that? So that was my giveaways and my advent calendars for today. And I can only imagine how much fun it's going to be uh, moving forward. So now, um, yesterday I posted a poll on my Instagram channel at mystitchdiary.com. So if you're interested in helping me decide what to stitch on every day, go hang out over there. Um, so one thing, one moment. Okay, so I had to stop the video because I forgot one thing. I got too excited about my giveaways and my advent calendar. Um, part of the whole purpose of doing this is for the stitching and the challenges that go along with the stitching. And what I decided to do this year was I have all my challenges in this really cute mason jar. I don't know if you can see the papers down there at the bottom. Um, and that's how I'm going to pick my challenges. So that's I'm gonna go there. I might bring the camera down a little bit just so you can see that bit better next time. Um, so let's begin again. So for the challenges part, um, I posted a um, poll on my Instagram. So that's at my stitch diary, and I did I put it up for 24 hours before today started. So until midnight yesterday or 11:30. And I let everybody who follows me on Instagram decide what I'm going to stitch on. So I believe it was between, if I'm not mistaken, Ganesha and 
let's see if I can remember. Uh, Ganesha and um, Golden Promises and Ganesha One. So that is what I'll be stitching on today. Now, now what we have to figure out is what the stitching challenge for Ganesha is going to be tonight. And that's where Santa comes in, my Santa messenger. My hand cannot fit in there, so that's why I have these. We're going to pick, let's see if this works out. All right, that's one. That seems like a lot of trouble. I might just pour one out into my hand next time. So the challenge for tonight's stitching. <laughs> well, that seemed uh, awful. Uh, it actually might work out. So here it says, take a break and watch a Christmas movie. I never say no to watching a Christmas movie. So I will do that. Um, I may or may not stitch anyway. But I'm happy to take a break and watch a Christmas movie because tonight is going to be busy anyway because my husband and I have uh, tickets to go see Stars on Ice. And so that's tonight. So it's going to be a late night anyway. And then by the time I come home, we'll see how much st stitching I actually get done. I do still want to get in my uh, Daily 100 done. So what I decided to do along with my Christmas countdown was to get some solid work put in on my Christmas piece. My one and only Christmas piece that I have in my um, whip collection at the moment, which is the, um, Christmas mailbox. And I, f I f was feeling like I was getting nowhere with it because it was just, I was doing extreme cross country stitching and <clears throat> stitching that one color of that pale pink for so long. I started in July and I am still doing that one pink. I'm almost finished. But because of that, um, I just, I just needed to move on with it and, and get somewhere with it. So I figured if I made it my daily 100, um, along with my Christmas countdown challenges that maybe I would actually make some progress on it this month. So a daily 100, for those of you who don't know, is, uh, when you pick a project and stitch da daily on it for 100 stitches. So technically, technically if I stitch on it every day for this countdown from today until the 25th, I should get 2,500 stitches put in. That should get me somewhere. I still haven't decided what is going to be my second color. I'm debating. I don't want to because, mm. anyway, I'll figure it out. I'll probably have to figure it out tonight. I got to get in 100 stitches at least. And since my challenge told me to take a break and watch a Christmas movie, I'll do that. But I may not take the break part. I, I'll watch a Christmas movie and maybe I might stitch on Ganesha at the same time. Um, I think maybe later on in the month, I might really just take the break. So that's fine. So I'm looking forward to my next video tomorrow and I'm so happy about the coffee and the yummy wax melts. <sighs> yeah, it smells like the ocean. So this has been lovely. Thank you for uh, coming and joining me and sharing in my countdown to Christmas. I can't wait till tomorrow. Bye everyone.